Hey there all, the merriest time of the year has returned and here is everything you need to know. The latter half is the new features for the 2022 year, here we go. Winter's Day is an annual festival that celebrates the Tyrian New Year with presents, snow, toys, and a whole bunch of limited time collectibles. The main currencies of the event being snowflakes and snow diamonds, snowflakes are found in the Winter's Day gifts, and snow diamonds are found inside the personalized Winter's Day gifts. These can all be collected by completing the various seasonal events. To get you started, just skadoodle on over to the Crown Pavilion inside Divinity's Reach. There you will find all the activities, the dungeon, Tixes, and Fanarium, probably saying that wrong, where you have to stop the deadly toys. Uh, then you have the Winter Wonderland jumping puzzle, which slowly kills you as you go through it. The Bell Choir Ensemble, which is a real-time action event where you get to sing your little heart out. Snowball Mayhem, which is a capture the flag style event where you get to murder people with snowballs. Toy Apocalypse, which is defending some cows against some angry possessed toys, I guess. Of course, there is some mount races. There's donation drives where you can give terribly shabby clothes to orphans, which is a little ironic seeing as you were literally the dragon commander and probably incredibly wealthy. You could afford something better, but hey, you know what? It is the season of giving. And even a limited time strike mission, the secret layer of the snowman, which sounds a lot worse when I actually say it out loud. Anyway, the big rewards from the Winter's Day gifts, like most seasonal events, are the unique weapon skins and of course the super rare infusions, such as the toy shell or the snow diamonds. Of course included are some guild hall decorations and a plethora of achievements for those who may be interested in completing those. The gem store most certainly will be jam packed with items that you may or may not want to spend your real life money on, but hey, it's your finances. I'm not your real dad. All right, now let's talk about the 2022 changes to Winter's Day. So the annual achievement this year is going to be the super festive snow boots. This is earned by completing the annual meta achievement while the intermediate step will unlock snow turf weapon box, which has a variety of bicycle style weapons. There are now a handful of unique skins that are available, including the great sword that looks like a nutcracker, a longbow that is basically an angry wreath, and a new war horn to scream in the winter's day festivities. There's also a few new guild hall decorations that can really ice out your place. Yeah. The gem store also includes a super plush, super soft siege turtle, as well as a host of new black lion claim ticket weapon skins. And that basically wraps up the 2022 Winter's Day. Lots of cool and fun things to do, so get out there and get frosty. If you're new to the game and you want to learn a little bit more about Guild Wars 2, here's everything that you can do in the game in under 5 minutes. Stay caffeinated, folks.